Silverton, Colorado. Any place to eat lunch here? Well, what are you doing, Chris? We're getting ready to hit the road. We have enjoyed this wonderful room. I enjoyed the shower. I never wanted to come out again, but I did eventually. <clears throat> I think Richard knocked on the door and said, hey, my yeah. turn. <laughs> yeah, get out of the shower, is what I said. Because <laughs> you, were, you were taking up some shower space. It felt good. It's all good. So today, we are ready to get, we're in Durango, and we're going to get on the a portion of the San Juan Skyway, ride it up to Silverton, and takes, and then Silverton on up to Uray. And the portion between Silverton and Uray is called the Million Dollar Highway. Mm -hmm. No one really knows why it's called that. There's all kinds of theories, but we weren't gonna, aren't going to go into that because then we'll get into conspiracy theories. <laughs> We're going to hopefully stop at the Idera, Idero mine. I'm not for sure how you pronounce that. I have never been. It's after Silverton. We're going to stop there. And Uray, we're going to look into stopping at the Box Canyon waterfall. Mm -hmm. Also another place we haven't been, so I'm really excited to see that. And after Uray, we are going to do what? After Uray, we're going in through Montrose and from Montrose over to Hotchkiss and then up 133 to a HIP camp, H-I-P camp. It, you're able to rent a space for your tent or sometimes they have uh, other accommodations on their properties um, to, to rent out. Usually wonderful, you know, beautiful area or stream or something. In this case, we'll be down by some big box elders and yes. underneath a large apple tree from what we were told. Yes, we're staying in a place called Teepee Haven. And I guess they have teepees there, but we're not staying in one of those. We're just gonna pitch our tent and camp out there. I wanted to do a quick note on hip camp. This is the first time that we used it and we learned a lesson. <laughs> We always do things wrong the first time. You get on their website, you can scroll through, and if you have a dollar amount, what you're looking for, they make it very easy because they'll put the dollar amount there. And I found this TP Haven for $25 a night. And we're on a very tight budget. I'd rather spend $20 a night or nothing, but that's me. So I thought, okay. She's, she's the accountant, remember? <laughs> So I thought, okay, we could do 25. Well, I forgot about taxes and fees and who knows what else they tacked on. And it ended up coming to $31 a night, which is way over our budget. So, but we're going to enjoy it. But I'm just letting you guys know if you get into hip camp, when you see that little price there, add on a percentage, 8%, 10%, something. Whatever the taxes are for that county, I imagine. Uh, yeah. So it's not that fee, it's that plus. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to head up from Durango. You can tell we're in a hotel room. After two weeks out camping, we needed to kind of scrub, do a deep scrub. <laughs> and then uh, heading up the lower part of the San Juan um, Skyway, right? Yep. San Juan Skyway. And then onto the Million Dollar Highway. And then into Montrose and uh, Hotchkiss today. Yes, I'm excited. Let's All right, go. Cheers. See you on the road. To Molis Pass and on a clear day you can see the big and little Molis Lake 
Again, we're kind of hazy. Oh yeah, you can. A little hazy because of whatever fire is going on out there. Let's go around and park on the edge. We're gonna so we straight pass. Pull Sorry. in. We're gonna pull in here, make a pit stop. But we're gonna walk up here and take. We're at Molas Pass, and we're gonna take a look at Little and Big Molas Lake. Is that what it is? That's what it's called. Little and Big. Yep. It's a big little. It's a big little oh, lake. Oh, and I got some information on the fire. It's down by Durango. And so far it's burnt like 3,000 acres and they just, the locals just brought in some federal help. So uh, they're trying to contain it. But so as we continue north, it'll start clearing up and things won't be so Yeah, um, I bet smuggy. it happened. I bet it happened not far from where we were camped. You gotta get a picture of this because, okay, so here's Richard's motorcycle and trailer. And then here's our tent. We are traveling in the laps laps of luxury compared to how they traveled back in 1870. <laughs> Don't you think? Peak two. I mean, you think they could have come up with a better name? Well, yeah, they were trying. <laughs> they were trying. Well, you get past uh, Silverton and it's Red Mountain one, two, and three. Oh. Is it really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just stick that in there. <laughs> oh, oh, is that what it was? <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying, I know. Yes. Nice little hidey hole to come back here and have lunch. In the cottonwoods. In the cottonwoods. <laughs> I mean, these aren't cottonwoods. These are aspens, but there are cottonwoods. Somewhere. Blowing all over the place. Per it's actually perfect because we can keep an eye on the bikes. Yep. Got a pretty view of the city. Or the Old Town livery, actually. Richard's going to attempt to back up his trailer <laughs> <laughs> on live TV, no pressure. <laughs> and I'm just going to stick my and butt out. And, <laughs> and a crowd right next to me. We'll and I'm just going <laughs> to, I'm just going to stick my butt out here. And... Yep. All right, here we it's go. It's clear. You got it. Piece of cake. Leaving Silverton, Colorado. Had a pretty good burger. Yep. On to Uray, but we're gonna stop at the Box Canyon Falls.
<laughs> well, it's, it's, it's low enough that I don't you know, wipe out. Yeah, because it, it literally double backs on itself twice. We? we got off the bike, so we were just gonna zoom mm -hmm. and go check things out. Mm -hmm. But no, we find, we found it. It is Box Canyon. Yes, Box Canyon Falls. Is where okay, so if you're coming to Box Canyon Falls and you turn left on Box Canyon Road, don't pull into the first parking lot. That's for unless you want to rock climb or ice climb. Keep going down the road to the actual Box Canyon.
where we're going to set up our camp for the next six days. This is home.